Hey y'all. Chef Man 77 here. That's short for Chef Man 1977. That's where you can find me on my YouTube. Soon to be putting out some nice little podcasts and stuff like that. But I haven't named that yet, but uh um I will and I'll let you guys know. Please listen. It's going to be great because it's going to be about everything and also about nothing. So I did a little video about this little thing right here. And it's like a, it's like a, uh, like a, uh, EDC carry belt carry thing. You run your belt through here, through here, through here, and you can keep a nice little bunch of stuff. And I actually have loaded it up with a bunch of different things. And all of this, what my speciality is, is budget. All this stuff is budget. This came from Walmart. And don't quote me on the price, but I think I paid four bucks for this. Amazon. I bought a pack of four of these and it was no more than 10 bucks. Walmart, an actual Walmart Leatherman type setup. This is Ozark Trail. Um, this is $7.88. It has a bunch of different tools on it. And for a guy like me who uses this stuff, but then again, doesn't use this stuff, this is perfect. Okay, and I'm on a budget. Like I said in my prior videos, I got kids in school. I got to feed people. I got to feed myself. This came from Walmart, not Walmart, but Home Depot. So DeWalt knife. I didn't pay any more than about 12 or 13 bucks for this. It's perfect. But what we're going to do this on today is this little thing. I got this off Timu. And it's not going to be the very best quality of material, but it's actually pretty decent material. I've been using this for a couple weeks. And this thing is wonderful if you're going to carry all of this stuff on you every day. And the reason why I carry all of this stuff on me every day is because I'm a truck driver. And sometimes you get in the back of the the trailer and it's early in the morning, you need a light or it's late in the evening, you need a light. And even sometimes you pull up to a dock and it's just not that much light in there. This light right here works good. And then you can also put this down in your shirt. It works fine. This right here, you never know what you need a glass breaker for or um, a pin, but I use pins all day, every day. The pin actually is pretty dope and it works pretty good. Leatherman, you can use a Leatherman for damn near anything in your life. You know, it's good that you don't have to carry it on your body, but you can keep one on you. This is not the best of quality, but I mean, for a person like me, it works out fine. And a knife, breaking down pallets, breaking down boxes, doing whatever it is. This thing is actually perfect. And if you look at it, bam. But you are looking for some some way to hold this. These little sheaths or whatever you want to call them, they go on your belt. They're perfect. They hold keys, whatever. But this thing, I'm in love with it. I literally am in love with it. And I think this thing was about four or five bucks on Timu. It takes a minute for it to get to you. But I mean, this thing is perfect if you don't mind anything hiding off your belt, or not hiding, but hanging off your belt. I just wanted to do an update and let everybody know of how this thing is working and if it was even worth your time and effort to go on to Timu and pick it up. And one thing I would say, if you can get it on Timu, they're on, they're on Amazon, all different colors, you know, brown colors, uh, light brown, coffee brown, dark brown. But these things are amazing, and I literally love it. And I would recommend this to anybody, especially anybody who's on a budget. Right here, this whole setup right here, 
generally you're into this setup, let's say 7, 15, you're into this budget for, you know, 50 bucks or under, under 50 bucks like this. And it's perfect. And you can pick, stop by Walmart or Home Depot or, or just go on to Amazon and pick one of these up. But I would recommend these to anybody who is getting started on EDC, Everyday Carry. That's what EDC stands for. I would recommend one of these uh, for anybody, whether you want to get it off Amazon, Timu, or wherever it is that you would pick these up from. These sheath EDC item carriers, I, I would recommend it. It's, it's perfect. It hugs tight to your body. Uh, it's absolutely perfect. I love this thing. But anyway, um, Chev Man 77 here just doing a little review on this little setup right here. Um, I recommend it. Go for it. And I'm going to go ahead and sign out for this evening. It's a good Saturday night. And uh, you have a good Saturday night or Sunday or Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday or Thursday or Friday or whatever day it is that you're having. Enjoy it. Like and subscribe to my videos. Um, to all the people, all my new subscribers that have subscribed and sent me those wonderful words, I appreciate you. And uh, sending some shots out to this guy on YouTube if you want to watch some really cool videos of uh, some people who actually have budget ish friendly in mind there's this guy it's max level edc and how you spell that is m a x l v l e d c love that guy he's killing it he doesn't just show you the most expensive of stuff on there he shows you actually some really good stuff that doesn't break your budget and he actually takes the time to look for the guys like us who are watching this um, and shows those budget EDC knives and things like that. Um, shout out to him. Thanks. I think it's like I said, I think it's max level EDC. And then, of course, my boy, he's not really my boy, but I like him and I like the way that he handles his business on YouTube and the way that he handles his channel. But his name is Marine x and then there's another guy best edc he tries he tries really hard to show budget stuff sometimes his budget is a little bit expensive for me but i like the way that he tries to at least show the one and two items and stuff that you can get on a budget at like ace or home depot or wherever it is that he goes into but uh Coming soon, and I know this is like the third video that I've showed on here, um, my budget EDC bags that I found at places like Ross, um, Burlington Co. Factory, and then another place here in Salt Lake City uh, called Recreation Outlet. I don't know where they actually span, but they're here in, Recre in Salt Lake City in Utah. But anyway, guys, have a good evening, and we will talk to you later. Thanks again to all my subscribers. Like and subscribe.